characters with the loud moves. He's just kind of mid, you know? I can hear. I can understand that. I can understand where you get that from. Oh my god, I'm going against Kiki next. Yes, you are. <laughs> that's who beat. That's who. Orange Bow beat Kiki in winners. That that's is how, wild. That's why he's here. That it is be wild. Be Kiki. I have to fight my gold. But we're about to see this fight. Orange Bow versus G Swizzy here. G Swizzard. Uh, started off with those arrows. Interesting, interesting. You know. You're not going to see Pit approach that much if uh, Samus is off stage just shooting off those arrows. But I mean, forced to interact in these situations, man. The parry? Oh my god! Okay. Ooh, charging up that charge shot right there. Down B trying to space himself out. But Orange Poe getting in. He's stopped by the jab. Also, shout out Samus. Metroid Prime Remastered, baby. I just bought that, by the way. I'm going to play that when I get home. Um, Orange Poe kind of going off here with the lead, but the back air almost killing. I forget how light, like, I don't know if Pit is light or that back air is just stupid strong. But either way, that almost killed, which is kind of wild at the percent Pit is at. Again, those bomb timings, very nice. Uh, charge shot, going through the arrow. Nice, I'm not gonna lie. Back air, not, back air not hitting. Charge shot, right in the face. Not killing, but I mean, Orange Poe is at 130, so any throw. Um, oh, I got my notification to moisturize my face, but um, any throw, not up throw, surprisingly. Back throw? No, instead, Orange Poe applying this pressure off stage. G Swizzy not getting the tech. Come on, man. You're playing Smash Ultimate in 2023 and you can't even tech? Just kidding. I shouldn't be saying that. I can't tech in any game. Whether yeah, it be Tekken, Strive. On a scale of 1 to 10, how is your, uh, what would you rate your skill, John Conboy? On, on what? Tekken? Uh, in Smash, and in general. Uh, what is your general know. overall skill? It's where, where's, where's 5? Where's 5? Where we 5 from? is like pretty mid, bro. Pretty mid? It's, it's actually the definition of mid. It's the middle of the rating. That is true. I put myself at a 6.5, maybe a 7. You think he's decent. Huh? <laughs> My bad! My bad, Max! My bad! And then he takes himself off the mic. Okay, Max. <laughs> Back to the game where G Swizzy takes his own charge shot to the face. Interesting decision, considering the fact we know uh, Orange Poe can put out that reflector on deck no matter when he wants to. But I mean, G Swizzy still has a stock to go, man. I'm still mad at what Max said. God damn, bro. Come on. But. We got Orange Poe at bad disadvantage. Meanwhile, G Swizzy staying in the lead. Uh, Orange Poe at 114 here, just kind of kind of trying to get back here, playing that catch-up game. Meanwhile, G Swizzy just like, I'm charging, I'm not, I'm charging, I'm not. Are you going to pull out your reflector? Maybe. I'm conditioning you not to. And the charge shot coming out. He pulled, he charged and didn't charge for like so many times that he just stopped uh, pulling out shield. And G Swizzy took advantage of that, taking the first game. Bro, I can't believe I gotta fight Kiki, man. <laughs> oh my god, Goblin is running stream? That's wild. Um, but what we got? Norfair. Oh no, we're going Battlefield. Triplats. I hate Triplats, by the way. Triplats kind of mid. But. Orange Poe going Bayonetta here in the, in the Samus matchup? I actually don't think I've seen this, like, this matchup ever. I'm not going to lie. Thinking about it, though, it's not going to be good on Bayonetta's end because, I mean, being the zoner that Samus is and having to be up close all the time, it makes it hard. And your tools getting in are mostly just side B and uh, maybe maybe an air. Maybe an up air. Falling up air. But G Swizzy obviously having an easy time here. Getting that Nair. Orange Poe not even getting a hit on G Swizzy yet. Ooh, catching him with the up smash. Zero. Oh my god. This court is like dragging my head down to the right. Um, yeah, Orange Poe not getting in a hit yet. Okay, never mind. Commentator's curse. Finally getting in that 40% there. G Swizzy though, having a hell of a lead. I'm not going to lie. Um... What's it called? Orange Poe just trying to get in. Finally getting that side B there. 73%. Ooh, we're not getting a kill yet. Or not getting a cut. Sick of burn. He's supposed to be up B out of shield. Thinking he's... I, I, 
No, I, I gotta stop making like speedy fighters. Definitely. Uh, okay. It's time for me to fight Kiki. Continue watching the set. Continue watching Aaron's stream, where we will be streaming Boardwalk Smash two Grand Finals for the Summit Qualifiers. I'll be back. What's up? Big Gobby here on the mic. Moist Boys, you know how it is. Put a one in the chat if you know how it is. Moist Boys season, Moist Boys season. All right. Moist Boys on the scene. Moist Boys on the scene. How y'all doing? Everyone say what's up to God. Right Everybody say what's up to me, Max Millie, and Orange Swi Orange Poe and po G Swizzy. Yeah. yeah. If you don't know Orange Poe, hot pit. Hot Bale. Potter Bale. Yeah, bro. Yo, you don't see this character that often. Yo, God, what do you think about Bale? Be honest. Uh, I think I, need to keep I think you could be what good with Bale, but I think Bale is really, 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 really hard where you got to be a little bit more than just good with Bale to make it count. That's what oh I think. Oh, my God. That's going to be the stock there. So we can see that Orange Po is doing way better this game with Bale than the last game with Pit. And people were saying that Orange Co was a Zach Ray fan boy. Um, Do you agree with that? Honestly, I'm going to have to disagree. And I'm going to have to say that Orange Co it actually inspired Zach Ray to put that pit on the scene. Yeah, I saw them talk to each other. He flew to Japan with me at the same time. I'm talking about Orange Co. Right? Yeah, Orange we, Co. We flew at the same exact time. We coincidentally were on the same flight. It was so crazy. We're like, what the fuck? And then I look next to my right, and I see him there. We're in the same seat aisle, too. What is this? He's like, honestly, I'm going just to teach Zach Ray some lessons. Um, he, he's really interested in the character, and I've been playing it for so long that yeah. uh, I think I can teach him a thing or two. So. Yeah, oh, and that's going to be it there. Yep. If you don't know how to DI that, that will <laughs> always kill you a thousand percent of the time. And that's the player cams. Shout out, shout out to Orange Poe for disconnecting his pro controller. Yep. Uh, yeah, we are getting some frame drops. I think it's the internet, but yeah, I'm gonna double check what's going internet's on. Internet's not looking too good today, but actually we haven't had any frame drops in uh, quite a while. Yeah, so you can't be consistent forever. We got Jorge stepping up the stream. You can be. Oh, that's me. 